Hi guys, it's Hilly Zafaro. Today I would like to show you a cool website called Twi, which is amazing for English teachers. Um, if you teach English, definitely English is a foreign language, you should check out this site. It allows you to, to generate texts and questions and dialogues and different activities, fill in the gap questions and just create amazing worksheets for you in seconds to review things that you've learned, vocabulary that you've learned, to generate more text, more questions, more activities, leading activities, post-reading activities, different things related to the text and also activities related to videos, YouTube videos. So you can take a song and ask questions about the song and have different questions about it in seconds. Um, you can uh, upload a video and uh, it could be a TED talk or any video that you see that you want to teach your students, you want to show your students, and it will generate questions based on the video in seconds. Everything will be downloaded, could be downloaded to a PDF file, and you can just distribute the pages to your students. Okay, so on Google, we write TWI, T-W-I-I, we go in, and we go through a sign-up process. Right here below, we click try it for free. Here we go through a sign-up process and we answer a few questions. We tick the box, I agree, with terms and conditions and get early access. Now we create a password. And let me in button. That's it. It says, thank you, we are so excited that you joined us, da 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 da. And now we need to go to our email and find an email from Twi, okay? That says, Twi, one more step and you're ready to go. And this is a com uh, confirmation email. So we click confirm your email. Then we'll be directed to the home page. Okay, so we go to our email and we look for the email and we confirm our um, enrollment or membership. That's it. As we go in, we can see that there are many, many different options here. Um, we can use YouTube video to text. We can create questions for YouTube video, summaries for YouTube video, create a warm up discussion questions for a video. Um, here we have create a text on a certain topic, create open questions to a text, create ABC questions for a text, many, many different type of questions, activities and things we can do on this website. So let me just show you just a few. Let's go with create questions for a YouTube video. I'm going to click. Now it's asking me to paste the video. And then a uh, type of questions. If I want open questions, A, B, C, D questions, which are multiple choice questions or true false statements. So I'm going to go with A, B, C questions. And here I'm going to paste a video. Let's say I want to go with Megan Trainer Better When I'm Dancing, which is a song. So I'm going to pick this song and click share right below and copy the link address. Going back to Twi. I'm going to paste the song right here. And now I'm going to click on do the magic. Okay, so we can already see questions. What is the title of the song? Better when I'm running, better when I'm singing, etc. Then we have who is the artist? Taylor Swift, Katy Perry, Megan Trainor, Ariana Grande. What should you do to feel better according to the song? Think about it, move your body, listen to the news or sleep. So as you can see, wonderful questions related to the, um, to the song I just posted and uh, pasted here. Now it's asking me to copy or edit. And of course, you can change things. So if I click edit, everything begins, everything is basically becomes editable. So I can edit things and change things inside. And if I don't want na na na, I want da da da. Okay. So anything you want to do, you can do it here. Then I'm going to click save and my edits uh, will be saved. Another option here is to say if I like it, if I don't like it, it's always good to say if you like something because it helps the system to get better. And it suggests more things. It says, don't stop, create using the video, video transcript, three summaries, 
discussion questions for a video. So let me click on discussion questions for a video. And um, it's, it's, um, it's prompting me to, um, to this page, create warm up discussion questions. And I have to click on do the magic again, because it basically gives me the same video again, but with a different tool. And you can see that it has five different questions. Do you like dancing? What kind of music makes you want to dance? Do you think dancing can make you feel better? Have you ever taken a dance class? Do you prefer dancing alone or with others? And again, it's prompting me to choose more things here to do with the video questions, summaries, transcript, etc. Note that on the left side of the screen, it says song trivia quiz, save as PDF. I'm going to click on save as PDF because now it creates a worksheet for me to give to my students. This is the worksheet. It's a PDF file and it doesn't have the answers, but it has everything I did. Discussion questions and quiz questions. Going back to the main page of Twee, I'm going to go with create a text on a certain topic. Now I'm going to ask it to uh, actually create a, a reading comprehension text and later on questions. So it's asking me what topic. So I'm going to write amazing teenagers around the world. Now genre text, it can also be a fictional story, informational letter, formal letter, review, descriptive article or argumentative article. I'm going to go with text level. We have simple, intermediate and advanced. So we have A1 to A2 would be elementary students. B1, B2 would be junior high and high school students. Advanced would be um, academia. So let's go with A1 to A2 for now. Target vocabulary. Now here you can simply paste vocabulary that you need to review or you want to teach or you want students to, uh, to practice. So I'm looking at my textbook and I'm writing a few words that I need to review with my students. Adventure, alone, country. So I wrote here or I typed all the vocabulary words I need to review. Now I'm going to click on do the magic. Here, as you can see, it's um, generating a text for me for A1, A2. Teenagers around the world are doing amazing things. Some of them are famous for their special talents or achievements. Ta -ta 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 -ta. And um, now you can click on shorten right below to make it shorter. Okay, so check this out. I'm going to click shorten. And we have a, a shorter version of everything. Much, much shorter. Okay. And right below, it's starting to offer me all these other options that we uh, the TWI allows. Look how it's dividing everything. In uh, orange here, you have exercises just for the words, just for the vocabulary words. For example, creative writing or uh, matching or um, discussion questions or word translation matching, etc. In green, you have things for the topic. Uh, find facts, famous quotes, essential vocabulary, reading bits and pieces. So things related to the topic. And here you have uh, create using the result, fill in the gap, ABC questions, true false statements, open questions. And what it is, it's basically, this is actually the best part. If you've just finished generating a text, you want to go to the blue part because the blue part gives you all those things to do with the result, with the text that you just generated. So based on the text you generated, we can now do fill in the gap, create uh, fill in the gap questions, uh, multiple choice questions, open questions. So let me show you one thing I created. I um, clicked on a dialogue on the same topic. Okay, so it's taking the text and it's now giving me another text that is a dialogue that is based on this text. So here you can see the text uh, it generated for me a minute ago. And here you have a dialogue based on this text. We have Tom and Lucy and they're talking about things in this text. Let's click on fill in the gap. 
As you can see, it's showing me the text again, and now it's telling me to highlight or to select words that I want to be in the fill in the gap um, exercise. So I'm going to choose the most interesting, the most, um, the, the, the newest words, the new vocabulary. Let's say worldwide competitions, participate, successful countries, and I'm gonna click do the magic. And as you can see, it generated the same text with uh, filling uh, the, with the, the blanks inside. Now I can click on another thing. I need to actually go up to find those again. And now I can choose leading activities because these are really cool. These we can do before we read the text. And I'm, again, I'm going to click do the magic and it's going to start and give me the leading activities. So it has some creative things. Ask your students to think about a famous person they admire and they admire and that they admire. Then encourage them to share their thoughts with the class. Students can practice using adjectives to describe the person and their achievements and use phrases like I find it amazing how or I think it's incredible that. So it's 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 actually pretty detailed. It actually gives you the um the sentence structure and the prompts, the way students should start the sentences, um, the scaffoldings. And again, here on the left, you have save as PDF. You click and it saves everything you've done into one PDF. You have the, um, the text, the dialogue, the fill in the gap questions and the leading activities. And in case you don't want the leading activities because it's not part of the worksheet, you just go to the warm up activities and you click on the little trash can icon, the delete icon, and you delete and it won't, um, it won't be inside the PDF. So that's it for now. In this video, I showed you how to create video activities. It can be even a song activity and also how to create text and um, activities and questions around that text to enhance reading comprehension skills. So I hope you enjoy it and on the next video I will go through more things on Tweet to show you how you can do more things related to grammar and vocabulary etc. But you can also experiment yourself and see the cool things inside. Enjoy and I'll see you next time. Bye bye!